to the surprise of, well, just about everyone, possibly including themselves, the stars of Jersey Shore have been back in the news lately. Granted, it's mostly because they starred in a Burger King commercial together, but hey, there's no such thing as bad publicity, right? Anyway, that's probably what Angelina Pivanik was thinking when she decided to randomly take a shot at Snooki in an interview recently published by In Touch. Angelina was removed from the cast permanently after From the House twice in as many seasons. Fans weren't particularly upset as Angie's um, hello. Might be the most obnoxious catchphrase in TV history. Pivanuk is a sad has been even by the standards of other reality TV sad has beens, so it's understandable that Pivanuk is now working hard to remind the world she exists, possibly in hopes of scoring some of that sweet PK endorsement cash. Discussing Snooki's recent lip injections for some reason, Angelina went off on her former shore rival, accusing the mother of two of stealing her style. She's trying to copy my look. Pivanik tells the tabloid. It's funny how she goes and gets her lips done at the same exact place that I got mine done. Yeah, so now all the times on, Jersey Shore, she used to call me ugly. Now she's trying to look like me. And if you remember Angie's tendency to mole hills into extremely irritating mountains, you won't be surprised that she didn't stop there. I don't really think, the new lips are doing much for her to be honest with you, Angelina adds. I don't know what the hell that's about but, whatever. But with me, I look totally different with it, you know? Never want to back down from a fight, Snooki responded to Angie's trash talk on social media. Damn I thought she changed. I gave her a compliment about her lips and she referred me to her doc. We're grown adults come and girl, Snooks tweeted because she's been waiting for one of her former castmates to mention her in a tweet for eight years, Angie was quick to respond. When I tried to contact you to thank you for that you ignored me. We need to grow up and put things past us. I tried, she tweeted. And naturally, Snooki replied, writing. Sorry I didn't get back to you. But you tried by talking crap about me to a magazine? All love here, just baffled. Ah. It's been a while since we witnessed a good Jersey Shore feud. The whole thing's got us wondering, were they always this boring?